Hey, this is Netlink Daily. I'm Jack, about to hit you with the tech news on a Tuesday. This morning, Microsoft held their EDU event, and there's a ton to talk about, so let's get straight to it. First off, Microsoft introduced a new Windows experience called Windows 10 S. Windows 10 S is a new lightweight education focused version of Windows that's said to be a competitor for Chrome OS. According to Windows Chief Terry Meyerson, the S stands for four different aspects, secure, superior performance, streamlined for simplicity, and the soul of Windows 10. Windows 10 S is kind of like Windows RT where it restricts users to Windows Store apps because Windows apps use less battery life and are more manageable than traditional apps. You can also upgrade from Windows 10 S to Windows 10 Pro for free if you're a student, and if you're not a student, it's $49. Microsoft also announced that Acer, Asus, Dell, Fujitsu, HP, Samsung, and Toshiba are all working on Windows 10 S devices, and entry-level devices will start at $189. Windows 10 S is expected to launch this summer. Next up at the event, Microsoft announced that Minecraft Education Edition is also receiving an update to include a tool called Code Builder. This new tool will be able to help students write codes that's used to move, build, and create in the game. Minecraft players only have to type slash code to start Code Builder. That in turn will activate platforms such as Tinker and Scratch X. If some gamers are more experienced, they can even switch to JavaScript. Last but not least, Microsoft announced the Surface Laptop. It's basically a straightforward notebook with some Surface aesthetics. It doesn't have a fancy hinge, no kickstand, it doesn't convert to a tablet, it's just a nice laptop. The Surface Laptop has a 13.5 inch pixel sense touchscreen with a 2256 by 1504 3x2 aspect ratio resolution, a keyboard wrapped in Alcantara, a USB 3 port, a headphone port, a mini display port. It's compatible with Surface Pens. The speakers are hidden behind the keys. It's powered by either an i5 or i7 chip and has an SSD that can go up to 512 gigs of storage. Microsoft claims that the Core i5 Surface laptop is 50% faster than the Core i7 MacBook Air and it's still lighter than the MacBook Air. Air. Battery life is rated up to 14.5 hours and it will be running Windows 10 S. The Surface Laptop starts at $999 US, comes in four colors, and is available next month in June. Okay, enough Microsoft news. Time for other stuff with <laughs> Lightning Round. Today, YouTube is applying a material designed to, well, YouTube for simplicity, consistency, and beauty. It's built on a new, faster framework called Polymer. You can head to youtube.com slash new to check it out. There's even a dark theme. It's pretty nice. I've been using it. Sony is working on a new high-end phone called the Xperia X Ultra, and it features a 6.45-inch screen with a 21 by 9 aspect ratio. So like an ultra-wide smartphone. It's kind of cool. Looks like Nvidia has some new low-end GPUs in the pipeline as a retail box shot of a GeForce GT 1030 was spotted on Spanish website El Chapuza Informatico. I don't know why I did that Informatico like that. It just felt right. HTC has announced that you can purchase a Vive Deluxe audio strap for the Vive headset starting June 6th. And Corsair has launched a new mid-tower gaming case, the Carbide Series Spec 04. It's $49.99 US, comes in three colors, and has cable management. Not too shabby for a wallet-friendly case. Sources for all today's news stories can be found in the NCIX Forum post that's linked down in the description. What did the RGB RAM say to all the other RAM? You're all dim. Thanks, Logan, for the Yo Dog submission. That's actually really clever. I chuckled when I read it earlier. If you have a joke or just something random for us to say, hit us up on Twitter with hashtag NCIX Yo Dog. <laughs> Dim. I get it. So, NCIX's 21st birthday has come and gone, but the 21st anniversary giveaway is still happening. Your last day to enter is May 7th, so what are you waiting for? You can enter to win one of three fantastic anniversary prize packs prize packs, including but not limited to the Ultimate Gamers Kit value at over $3,000. Whoa! $3,000 Canadian. So, click up here or down in the description for more details. The NCIX 21st Anniversary Giveaway, because free stuff is awesome!
All right, that's it for Netlane Daily. Thank you so much for watching. Click over here for previous videos and check us out on Twitter over there. But as always, like the video if you liked it, comment down below for fans with benefits, and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. Bye now, it's time for lunch.